Russia's fifth-generation Sukhoi Su-57 Felon, now equipped with second-stage AL-51F1 after burning turbofan engine. The second-stage AL-51F1 engine is the final component that makes the Russian-made Su-57 fully compliant with the country's fifth-generation fighter requirements. One of Russia's television stations has aired the trailer for Masters of the Sky, a film dedicated to the 85th anniversary of the Pavel Sukhoi Experimental Design Bureau. The film has garnered attention as, for the first time, showcase the fifth-generation Su-57 fighter jet equipped with the second-stage engine, the AL-51F1, featuring a flat nozzle and deflectable thrust vectoring. The trailer includes footage of the T-52 prototype aircraft equipped with the long-awaited propulsion system, along with the Su-57M, featuring two second-stage AL-51F1 engines. The AL-51F1 engine is the final component that makes the Russian-made Su-57 fully compliant with the country's fifth-generation fighter requirements. These requirements include multifunctionality, stealth technology, ultra-maneuverability, pilot situational awareness, a substantial combat payload with high-precision long-range missiles, and supersonic flight in super-cruise mode without the use of afterburners. The ability to sustain supersonic flight without afterburners offers key operational benefits, such as fuel efficiency, lower heat signature, extended combat radius, faster response time, stealth advantage, operational flexibility, air superiority, and engine longevity. The fulfillment of the final criterion, supersonic flight without afterburners, has been achieved with the second stage engine. The Su-57 represents an impressive feat of engineering, as its ability to achieve Mach 2 without afterburners demonstrates the aircraft's advanced design and technology. This supercruise capability allows the Su-57 to sustain supersonic speeds without afterburner activation, which otherwise consumes significant fuel and produces a large heat signature. The information revealed in the film regarding the Su-57 with the AL-51F1 engine confirms that the propulsion system is now ready, tested, and prepared for standard installation. In December 2023, Russian Air Force sources told TASS about plans to equip all Su-57s produced at the Komsomolsk on Amur aircraft manufacturing facility with AL-51F1 engines starting in 2024. However, fighter jets delivered last year by United Aircraft Corporation UAC, to the Russian Air Force were still fitted with the first stage AL-41F1 engines. The development of the second stage AL-51F1 engine for the Su-57 is being carried out by the Arkip Lyolka Design Bureau. The first bench Su-57 prototype launch took place on November 11, 2016, while flight tests began in December 2017 using the prototype aircraft with tail sign 052. The second stage engine was first officially presented under the AL-51F1 designation in July 2023 at a scientific and technical conference on engine development prospects held at Samara Technical University during a presentation by ODK Kuznetsov, the second stage engine for the Su-57 was labeled AL-51F1 on one of the slides. With the Su-57's maximum takeoff weight exceeding 35 tons, the aircraft's thrust-to-weight ratio is expected to exceed 1, reaching approximately 1.15 to 1.2 at normal takeoff weight. Currently, this parameter stands at 1.09 for normal takeoff weight and 0.97 for full takeoff weight. If you like this video, don't forget to subscribe the channel to get more videos and wait for the next video.